Hi, this is Dr. Srikant from Team MDS Conquer. Now I'll be explaining different types of nodules that are seen in the thyroid gland. As we know, the scintigraphy is one of the modality in identifying the abnormality in the thyroid glands on which an isotope is given and multiple radiographs are taken. Basing upon which the nodule can be divided into hot, warm and cold. Guys, please make a note of this order. Hot followed by warm followed by cold. Hot nodule is the one in which the abnormal tissue is going to take the isotope whereas the surrounding normal tissue is not going to take any sort of isotope. You can clearly appreciate in this diagram that the abnormal tissue is going to take the isotope whereas the surrounding normal tissue is not going to take any sort of isotope. The second one is a warm nodule in which the abnormal tissue as well as the surrounding tissue take the isotope. You can clearly see where the abnormal tissue as well as the surrounding normal tissue are going to take the isotope and in this radiograph you can clearly differentiate the anatomy of the thyroid gland where the abnormal as well as the normal surrounding thyroid gland they absorbs the isotope. Moving to the third category that is the cold nodule is the one in which the abnormal tissue is not going to take the isotope. You can clearly appreciate here the abnormal tissue is it's not going to take any sort of isotope. This is a slight difference between a cold, warm and hot. Okay, they may ask a diagram based question or they can ask a theoretical based question. I hope now you got a clarity basing upon the difference between hot, warm and cold. Hope you like this video. We'll be coming with one more video in a very shorter time. Thank you all. Click on subscribe button and press bell icon to get notifications.